Good morning, everyone. This is uh, morning devotion from uh, I'll read from Micah chapter five, verse two. And this verse always we bring out uh, during Christmas, and we enjoy this uh, portion from this uh, Micah chapter five, verse two, that it speaks about Bethlehem and how Bethlehem, uh, and in those time was not so important, and and it was so little among thousand uh, Judah. And I was thinking, like now, how uh, Bethlehem has been uh, been a very important place as a memory and as a uh, as a like uh, we know that Savior was born in Bethlehem. But there, here is a passage I, I, I like the uh, uh, expression in verse two. But you Bethlehem, Ephrathah, like though you are little among the thousands of Judah. Yet out of you shall come forth to me the one to be ruler in Israel, whose goings forth are from the from of old, from everlasting. Is it amazing that uh, you are little, you are little among thousands of Judah. You are little, and you can say that uh, this morning we 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 were nothing, we were little, and how yet, yet from uh, yeah even if. Uh, Bethlehem, oh Ephrathah is little, yet, yet is important, yet out of you shall come forth to me the one to be ruler in Israel. Like, uh, uh, maybe the world do not recognize this, maybe uh, in this, uh, remember uh, when we look at the passages in Matthew and Luke, and how uh, nobody recognized that Messiah is going to be born, uh, that night, or uh, the, uh, and and he never uh, got a place uh, in 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 uh, Bethlehem, and he was born in manger, and we know that, and uh, how little Bethlehem, yet out of you, someone is going to be born, and isn't it like uh, nobody is going to see the kingdom of God unless they are born again, and and we we were uh, born again because of. Uh, Christ's life because of Christ died on that cross and we believed it <laughs> we just believed it and and we were little we were nothing we were no one we were unknown here and and we were tasteless we were like uh, we were uh, we had no capacity we had no uh, love in us like now love is born in us now love has born in us like love has deposited in our life in uh, uh, Romans chapter 5 5 uh, the love through Holy Spirit is being deposited in our heart in our life and now we have significance we we in a sense uh, now we are recognized we are we have identity uh, uh, like if you remember like in Psalms 113 yeah, for a moment we can turn that passage uh, it's about like how we were miserable and how we were far away from God even Ephesians chapter 2 we were enemy uh, in, in God's uh, eyes uh, but chapter Psalms 113 says that for the first for the Lord is high above all the nations his glory above the heavens who is like the Lord our God who dwells on high six who humbles himself to behold the things that are in the earth heavens and in the earth Seven, he raises the poor out of the dust and lifts the needy out of the ash heap that he may sit him with princes, with the princes of his people. He grants the barren woman a home like a joyful mother of children. Like he may sit him with the princes, with the princes of his people. Uh, he lifts the needy out of ash heap. Like we were raised of the ash, ash heap. He raises the poor out of the dust. <clears throat> our life is our, our life was dusty and meaningless and purposeless. Uh, we were little, and God lifted lifted us up. He made us seated in heavenly places at the right hand of His uh, hand, like Jesus. We are at the right hand of Jesus, and we have uh, so much uh, importance in us. And we are royal. We have a royal priesthood, royal nation. Uh, we are. Uh, children of God and and the treasure is in this earthen vessel yet persecuted and uh, maybe uh, pressed from all sides but yet not destroyed 
because of the treasure we have the the meaning we have the purpose we have the importance we have which christ has bestowed upon us that love because of that we are uh, we are now joyful we have a love because god has deposited all oh bethlehem afratha little among thousands you know little among thousands little not not much but uh, we were our life was in ash uh, heap and how god lifted up and like well, lastly like how even uh, david was like uh, told in <coughs> chapter 7 was 8 second samuel chapter 7 verse 8 closing now therefore thus shall say you to my servant david thus says the lord of hosts i took you from the sheep fold from following the sheep following the sheep but now to be ruler over my people over israel took you from the sheep fold from following the sheep to be ruler over my people over israel how god gives that to us how god uh, promotes us that is called divine promotion a divine promotion is like we are seated in heavenly places we have a, a divine uh, participation in body of christ uh, we are we were little we were nothing now god gave that uh, design uh, the new design the new life where we have a great importance great role to play in this on this earth uh, well uh, unknown in on earth but well known uh, by god he knows our life hidden in christ so let's serve christ let's serve him knowing that uh, he he is born in us he is born in us we are born again because of uh, uh, his deposit his life is deposited in us and and let's serve faithfully today and for this year and amen thank you